Remember, if your Red Alliance wins, they will be our event champions. If the Blue Alliance wins, we will go to a tiebreaker. Up goes Team Rice. 43 to 24 in favor of the Red as we move into teleoperated mode. Little over two minutes left to play. Snipe Pulse quickly moving over, adding a cone to the power grid. While the Psychotics pick up a cone for the Red in their human player station. Team Rice again moving out in the center, picking up another cone, laying in the middle of the field while the Kingsmen look to deliver another piece for the Blue Alliance. Mohawks grabbing their, using their spinnaker, grabbing another cube down, looking to head over, trying to add another cube down below, scoring it in place. Northport Robotics now, looking to maneuver, trying to pick that other cube up. Running into their teammate, Kingsman running interference now, losing their cone in the process. Kingsman looking to recover, trying to see if they can get another game piece, while Team Rice scores uninvaded. They Stipe Pulse again, continuing to add pieces to the power grid for the Red Alliance. 65 seconds left to go. Stipe Pulse and Rice over there at the Red Player Station. While Northport continues to add another piece to, for the blue, followed by the Kingsmen, adding more to their power grid. 45 seconds left to play now. Pulse maneuvering, dropping another cube in place. Another link completed for the red. The blue working hard to catch up. Kingsmen now looking at a note another cone to a node, completing another link as well for the blue. End game now in play, Psychotics up on the Red Alliance charge station. Northport looking to add another piece before they climb to. Mohawks adding another piece down low. They're gonna cut it close. 12, 10 seconds now left. Red Robots balancing. Northport falling off the side. Final score coming up. Let's have a huge round of applause for the Blue Alliance team members for their performance here at this event.